What is shaping up to be the big story on Christmas and the days after severe weather that could strand many of the 93 million Americans who traveled for the holiday. That's right. Not one, but two huge storms are taking shape and set to strike right after you open your presents. Meteorologist Ginger Z is here with the details. Good morning, Ginger. Hey, good morning, guys. It is going to be an interesting week. Very active weather on the way, and it starts with this storm. This is a Christmas Eve light snow from eastern Michigan, northern Ohio, into parts of New York, even to Boston. So will you have a white Christmas? I think you can see a flake or two mixing in on the backside here in the big cities on the East Coast, but it's not going to be that big of a storm. The big one has already started and it brought a lot of rain causing accidents in San Jose, California. They had almost a half inch of rain. San Francisco almost an inch. Not good on the roadways there and talk about bad roads. Look at the next part here in the Sierras. By the time this thing is done with them, five to even six feet of snow. So great for skiers. Horrible there as it turned into a parking lot on some of their highways. So that's the second storm. It has started. It's going to cross over tonight into early tomorrow. And here's where it gets interesting. Earlier I said to Dan and Bianca, geez, oh, Pete's. When I was looking at some of the computer <laughs> models, I gave it a good old good western or midwestern um, idea because eastern Oklahoma and western Arkansas and some of those computer models are over a foot of snow. This is on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Then you look into, and that's mostly Christmas Day, but watch this as it moves. And this is where I think we could see some major travel troubles. Wednesday, ice up in the New England, rain here in parts of the Northeast, a lot of snow back to the West. It finally exits Thursday into Friday, but that's when all the people are traveling. So we will keep an eye on this, of course, and I'll have more in the nation's weather coming up. Dan and Bianca. Ginger, I know you're excited about the weather when you say Jizo Peak. <laughs> I actually had to look it up online. It translates roughly into wow. Yeah, yeah. that's it.